So what we've been working on recently is standing. Once you, when you're out working and you need to stop, you give them the command of whoa, which to them is supposed to mean that you stop immediately and you don't move until you're told to move. It's the most important uh, command and it's a matter of safety. It could also be a matter of life and death at some point in your time when you're working with oxen. Uh, it's been very hot here in north central Florida almost every day uh, between 95 and 100 degrees so we picked this little spot of shade um, for him to be more comfortable in. So once we come to a stop I should be able to walk away and he should stand there until he's told to move. So he's almost two years old and he's doing very well and we'll see how long he's going to stand. It's, it's a hard command. There's a lot of distractions whether there's something to eat or something that uh, another cow or another, another ox or just something that distracts him to move. But this is a very, very important command. Whoa, come in. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Right now we're just at the end of the fly season, so he's being harassed by flies. Whoa, Kalyan. Good boy. Whoa. So sometimes you might have to let them stand for 15, 20 minutes while you're loading a wagon or a sled or something. Um, but he should be able to just stand until he's told to move. So the other cows in the next pasture are making some noise, so he's a little bit attracted to that. But so far he's doing a very good job of standing. We can't make a 15 minute <laughs> video of standing for you, although it would be nice to see how he does. But he is doing very well. Good boy, Kalyan. Whoa, Kalyan. Good boy. And it's really important when they do things right that you give them the uh, recognition that they're doing everything is right. Sometimes they do things wrong. Once again, they're in the beginning of their training. So it's not going to be 100% right from the get-go. But he's doing a good job. And he gets a little massage. Good boy, Kalyan. Good boy. So when I take him back to wherever he is going and we finish work, you should also tell him when he's done and everything is put away, you're going to need to tell him to, to get up. Otherwise, he's just going to stand there for who knows how long. I but, have a question. Yes. Um, how do you know when you've got the standing down as, you know, perfectly or as good as you should have it? Well, as time goes on and we do more and more work, more and more training, they will exhibit that they're going to stand. So it may take a while, um, and it depends on the animal also, and the relationship that you have with the, with the ox. But he's been standing here now for about 20 minutes while we're getting the camera ready and this and that and whatever else. But he's doing very good. He's just standing. So how often do you practice the standing? The standing can be practiced many times during a training session. You could do a left turn or a right turn, and then after they completed the turn, you can tell them to whoa, and then walk away from them. It could be done 10 times in a training session, 20 times. Now when we go back to the barn, he's going to have to wait while I open the gate. So that means we're going to get close to the gate. I'm going to tell him whoa. I'm going to walk away from him, open the gate, come back to him, tell him to get up. We go through the gate, I tell him to whoa, he's going to stand, I'm going to close the gate. So there's many different times during a training session that you can practice whoa. The more the better. Whoa, you mean stand? Whoa means 
stop and stand you can use a, another word if you want for stand you can say stand but most people just use the word woe to mean stop immediately and stand coming up coming up 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 Kalian, whoa. Good boy. Whoa. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy, Kalian. So this is a subliminal way of training also. That he's standing, he's getting a massage. So anybody who's had massage, they're not gonna get up and, and walk away from it. Massage is feels good, they're happy. So it's a bit of a subliminal training. Good boy. Okay folks, thanks for watching. YouTube channel, hit the subscribe button. ISCAP 108. Good boy. Thank you.